NASA is getting sued for dropping a piece of space trash on a family's home in Florida. Earlier this year, a two-pound cylinder-shaped object crashed through the roof of a house in Florida, creating a hole in the ceiling and the floor. That coincided with the re-entry of a massive pallet of old batteries that was tossed from the International Space Station, which plummeted its way through the atmosphere on the same day over the Gulf of Mexico. In March 2021, NASA tossed a nearly 6,000-pound cargo pallet containing nine batteries, making it the heaviest piece of trash that's ever ever been thrown out from the ISS. The pallet was then left to tumble its way towards Earth in an uncontrolled re-entry and finally made its way down on March 8th. A small fragment from the flight support equipment used to mount the batteries onto the pallet survived re-entry and ended up in a Florida family's home. The family reported the incident and NASA retrieved the object for analysis, confirming that it was in fact the space agency's trash. Now the family is suing NASA for property damage and emotional and mental anguish. I mean, I get it, get that money. Now keep in mind this is a rare case of space debris surviving re-entry and landing on someone's personal property. but it is telling of the times as more spacecraft, rockets, satellites, and even batteries make their way to low earth orbit and eventually have to make their way back down.